Hello guys, this is a video on how to find out the center of mass of a non-uniform rod given uh, linear mass density lambda is lambda naught into x. In my last video I told you how to find out the center of mass of a uniform rod but this is a non-uniform rod which means mass is not uniformly distributed over the rod. So it is distributed in a way lambda is lambda naught x. So uh, I have chosen likewise uh, an elemental length dx and having elemental mass dm L, capital L is the length of the entire rod and this dx is at a distance x and the center of mass coordinate is integral x dm by integral dm since this is a non-uniform rod we need to integrate uh, the numerator and also the denominator so let's see how to uh, forward this so like I can take lambda is dm by dx so dm can be written as lambda into dx so i'll put two things here and my uh, limits are again from 0 to l the entire length so 0 to l and also 0 to l so let's forward this so this is 0 to l x dm is lambda dx lambda dx and divided by here 0 to l dm is again lambda dx now this is 0 to l in place of lambda i can write lambda naught into x so i want to write lambda naught don't cancel lambda because it is depending on x so lambda naught can be cancelled because it's a constant so x into lambda naught into x dx and over 0 to l and lambda is again lambda naught into x dx so now i can take lambda naught outside and 0 to l x square dx upon lambda naught 0 to l x dx now you can cancel lambda naught so i have uh, the next step to be so the integration of x square is x cube over 3 from 0 to L and the integration of x is x is x square by 2 from 0 to L and this would be L cube by 3 upon L square by 2. So this is L square gets cancelled and you left with 2L by 3. So this is the answer 2L by 3. So center of mass lies at a distance of 2L by 3 from the origin. It's not L by 2. If the rod is uniform, it lies at L by 2. Since it is non-uniform and the relation is given as lambda is equal to lambda naught into x. So the center of mass lies at 2L by 3 from the center. So I hope you understand.